Okay, what makes nose comes down this? I'm so smart, guys. All right, what's good, gang? Welcome back. We are sticking with the medium. Ooh, ooh. So, <laughs> so, last episode, uh, we finally got the bolt cutters and we made it into the day room. We had a little cutscene with our homie Sadness. That was a little spooky. So, um, I feel like it's about to pop off in this day room. We will see, though. All right, y'all. Let's see what we got going on in the day room. I'm a little scared, not gonna lie. I feel like some bad things are about to happen. The homie Sadness was really scared, and that leads me to believe that there was probably some uh, shicey things going on. Because, huh, Sadness got real worried, real scared uh, when we brought that up. So, we'll see. Here we go again. My game did not crash. Although it seemed to be slicing pretty fast, so I think we're fine. Because previously, other episodes, this part would take forever. Okay. Now she turned around like I did it. Girl. What's going on in here? Richard? Are you there? You don't have to stop with these little outbursts, girl. Alright, um. I'm scared, but let's see what we're working with. Here we go. I gotta look at two screens now. Aww. Gather round, children. Richard? I want you to meet Lillian. She's going to be joining our painting class. It's a good picture. Why can't I play with my friends, Uncle Richard? Your friends? Oh, Lillian, I I promised your father you would spend some time with the other children. Friends, huh? So Lillian was the girl in that other letter where they were talking about it sounded like she's talking to multiple people. What's this about? Read it. Okay. I spent a few years trying to steer him in the right direction, trying to make him see the depth of his potential. He kept refusing, claiming that he was no painter and that he saw our little get togethers as therapy rather than artistic expression. Eventually, I wore him down. He agreed to enter the university, but on the condition that it would be in his chosen field. And so he started on his way to becoming an architect. At first, I was rather skeptical, thinking that he was throwing away his greatness for mere competence. But deep inside, I guess I was glad to be the only one to bring his visions to life. And then he met her. Our painting sessions be became few and far between. He no longer needed my help dealing with his inner demons. Okay. All right. Let us investigate, Chow. Do I need a boot? How do I? How do I jump out my body? I forget. All I forgot all my controls. This one. No. How do I get over there? I thought I could. I thought I could bibbity boppity boo. Never mind. I thought I could get past it, but never mind. Okay. Got a couch. What's going on here? Another letter. A very special boy. I don't like where that's going. Okay. I remember the first time I met him, working a simple factory job. Still more of a boy than a man. Wide-eyed, constantly looking over his shoulder like a scared animal. His parents had died in the Warsaw Uprising. Of what he'd gone through in the years that followed, he did not of what he'd gone through in the years that followed, he did not want to speak, and I never pressed him. But it soon became clear. He had no one else in this world. I can immediately tell that, despite his young age, he had seen things that no one his age should. I could, I could immediately tell he was special. What does that mean? What are we talking about? Oh, one of these things. How do I do this? I forgot how to do anything. All right. Nope. Nope. That's not it. I. Why is it so difficult? It, I'm. I'm doing it. 
There we go. Jesus. Don't you think he would be better off in a nursing home? What about his family? Richard doesn't have any family. Poor Richard. Oh, the poor man. It's like he's somewhere else. We were close once, you know. I mean, not that close, but... All right. I'll take care of him. Hollow like a puppet. Isn't that what sadness said? What's wrong with Richard? Oh. Who? Hold on now. Before we go over there, let's make sure I'm not missing anything. Look at these letters. A well of inspiration. Thomas, I've always been stunned by the depth and complexity of his imagination. Memori mesmerized by the surreal dreamscapes his mind would weave. The way he described them, with every minute detail, it was as if he had actually witnessed all of it. As if something, or someone, pulled the veil and allowed him to peek beyond the edges of our reality. An angel? A demon? Is there really a difference? I know it didn't matter to me as his visions came alive on my canvas. Some would say I used the boy to fuel my waning creativity, but how could I not? To let this unique perspective, this bottomless well of inspiration go to waste? That would be an unforgivable sin. What's going on here? I to make sure I've investigated everything in here. A sheet of music. Hmm. What is this? Oh, that's where I came through. Okay, so we went around the room. So... I don't know, is there an order I'm supposed to be doing things in, or am I just fighting? Uh, locked. Locked. Okay. And I can't out of body it. Oh, I can. Okay. What is this? The equator. What is that for? Is this here? I don't know what I'm looking at. Also, what is this? I don't know if I needed that thing, but all right, let me get back in my body. I guess we need to go over here. Am I stuck? What's we doing? What are we doing? Okay. I already looked at this thing, right? Yeah. Um, alright, how do I... No, go this one, go this one, go this one. I don't have any juice. I don't have any juice. How am I supposed to juice up? Don't you think he would... What about his... Richard. How do I juice we were up? All right. Did I miss the juice somewhere? Didn't I look at something over here? I need juice. I have no juice. Where do I get juice? I don't have any juice. I can't blast them away. Another piece of paper or music. Sheet music. Oh, this place is packed with memories. Bad, Bad ones. This. Guilt. Humiliation. Rage. Guilt, humiliation, and rage. It's not a good combination. A method to madness. It became a habit of ours. We'd sit down, sketchbook at the ready, and then he'd close his eyes and start talking. 
describing all the things he saw in his, his mind's eye, the horror and splendor of worlds beyond our own. What started out as an innocent exercise in imagination ultimately became a bottomless well of inspiration. My hand wouldn't dare rest, sketch, sketching furiously as he described the indescribable. For a while, I wondered why he was so eager to share his visions with me. To him, they seemed to be a burden, a source of great pain and distress. But finally, I understood. He sought to share them with someone who saw them as a source of beauty rather than madness. Okay. Mm. Oh, that looks like I got one here. Okay. What do I do now? Oh, wait. I'm. Oh, that looks like a face. No, that's a nose. And then we have a mouth. And then eyes. I feel like. Oh. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Because. We need to get this in order, I would imagine. Okay. No. That's as far as that goes. Okay. Alright. That's not the way I wanted that to go at all. I need the eyes up top. I feel like... We went the wrong way. Okay. How do I do this? <laughs> I don't understand. I am confusion. That's as far as that goes. That went the wrong way. Y'all know how I am with these puzzles. Y'all know I struggle with puzzles really bad. I don't, I understand that clicking, clicking them with them, right? <laughs> but I need to click them in a way that makes this make sense because this looks like a face, right? We got a nose, got eyes, and the other thing is a mouth. So we need to make a face is what I'm gathering here. But how do we do that? No. Okay. Move you first. If I move that up, it moves the eyes down. If I move that up, it moves the mouth up. And if I move the eyes, it moves the mouth down. I needed to write that down. Okay. All right. We're going to do this again. We got this one. Smart. Okay. Nose. Mouth. Eyes. So when I click the nose, it's right there. Nose goes up, eyes go down. When I click the mouth, mouth goes up, nose goes down. And then when I click the eyes, eyes go up, mouth goes down. So I need the eyes at the top. So we get the eyes up top. Okay. Let's see. Well, I'm just going to play around a little bit. Okay, so. What makes the nose go down? The mouth. Okay, what makes nose comes down this? I'm so smart, guys. I just, I just had to read it down. Another junction. Oh, it's one of these things. Maybe it can show me a way out of here.
nothing's happening. You're just twirling. Okay. Is that... Okay. Y'all, I'm so smart. I can't believe I got that puzzle. I'm so proud of myself. Oh, did that get me around the, the thingy? Ew. Got me my juice. Ew. What's this? Y'all, I'm so proud of myself. Why, why are these things so difficult for me? Hold on. Okay. I'm right there, am I not? Is that not it? It's like so specific. There. I love this melody. It reminds me of my childhood. Okay. Uh, at least the good parts of it. But the bad parts, they're always there. Is that sadness? Aren't they? You're a very smart girl, Lily. You know that, don't Is you? Is sadness a thing? Is sadness, you sadness are Lily? Special. Special? What do you mean? Her voice. Is that. I said it. Sadness? I said it. That sounds like sadness. What happened to sadness? What y'all did? Let me find out y'all did something to sadness. Give me that. Uh, the spark's too weak to absorb. I gotta find something first. It's like it's missing something. Probably the the music. Aha. Uh -huh. What was that? Teacher's room key. Oh, that doorbell was locked. Who's this? I can't pick that up. Okay. So that doorbell was locked. Okay, right, let me slice. Y'all, I'm feeling so proud of myself right now. I feel like I'm doing really good. And now that I said that, watch what happens. Oh, here go to skin bugging. But we are doing really good, y'all. I am so proud of myself right now. We just solving puzzles. We figure out sadness, real name. What happened to sadness? Because why is your name sadness now? What y'all did to sadness? Let me find out y'all did something to sadness. Let me find out y'all did something to sadness. Okay, um, where's my inventory? So I have two pieces of sheet music. I feel like I need the third piece. That would make more sense. I can't walk through there because I don't have enough juice yet. So, oh, is this the, the locked door? It is. What did y'all do to the homie sadness? Come on, Richard. You were always there when I needed you. Let me return the favor. Ah, uh, I don't know, Thomas. What about my work? The university? Richard, I know they kicked you out. Knock it down. I'm guessing you finally managed to piss off the right people. Stay with us, old friend. No, old friend. Do it for me. For them. So, he brought him here. Richard brought mm -hmm. Thomas here. Who's them? I wonder who he meant by them. You worried about what happened with Thomas. I want to know what they did to Sadness. point you know love to see it okay another one once he got engaged we grew apart for a while now that i think of it i guess i was jealous i no longer had him all for myself in time i warmed up to her as well she was striking both in her beauty and intellect eventually i accepted the fact that he has found true happiness true love strong and pure well as pure as it can be i guess 
In any case, I was no longer needed. When the project came along, the one that would eventually be known as Neva, I pulled all my strings to get him what he wanted. Even though I knew it would drive a, an even bigger wedge between us, I wanted the best for him. He was the closest to a son that I'd ever had. Okay, girl. His glasses. Okay, come on. Bro, why are, what, is it, is it me? Am I? Am I the problem so with these? So, that's how you found him? Yes, he was just lying there. He, uh... Mr. Rakovich? He what? I, I'm sorry. He, he was a friend. I just... Uh, need a moment. What happened? That's not true, Thomas. You thought he... deserved it. Huh? I'm confusing. Y'all know I, it take me a little while to get things. So what do I do with the sheet music? Oh, do I need to go back to... Where did I come from? Over here. Not y'all. Move. Over here. Um, no. This one? Over here. Unless that's the same room anyways, but whatever. Over here. Yeah, that's the piano. How do I combine these? How do I combine them? Uh -uh. How, do, how do I combine things? Oh, there we go. Okay, wait. Part one, part two, part one and two, part three, voila. Now, oh, here we go. Here he is. Me up. All right, y'all. Not too much with the music. Your hand, this way. There we go. Here we go. My fault. Last time I didn't do it, there were what I was supposed to do. I hit. I was holding the wrong button, so when I went this way, I died. Oh, y'all see that hand? Dog, come on now. Y'all see the hand? That's terrifying. Bro, what? What's over here? What you did to the homie Uncle status? Richard, my arms are getting tired. You've been drawing me for hours. Almost done. You know, Lily, you remind me of someone. A girl I knew when I was very young. Did you love her? No, did you love her? Yes. With a young, innocent love, free of the ferocity of adult lives. Richard. Oh, I'm getting a weird vibe from him. What Richard There's did? Grief, sorrow, and something else. Something else like what? Ooh, we got sparklies. Y'all know I like to have some guidance, shall. Who is this? Over here. I need to know. Uh, am I the only person that has troubles with this? Because it feels like I'm the problem here. Like I'm so close but so far away. Oh my god, bro. What like what was different? What was different? Aren't you a bit old to be playing with dolls? Here. I bought it especially for you. What do you mean? Oh, a ribbon? It's beautiful. Thank you, Uncle Richard. Here, let me um 
On the other hand, why don't you do it yourself? Ah, what was that? It's like something stirred inside him. You, oh, I bet. Oh, Richard, when I find you, is that why the hit? Mm, Richard, when I find you. <laughs> Richard, when I find you, Richard. Crossing up. Is that why the hand's there? Is that what we're getting at? Because if that's what we're getting at, I'm about to get mad. Not the ribbon. Please. No, I didn't mean to. Oh, God. What have I done? It feels cold. What have you done? Uh. Oh, girl, don't do that. That hand is stressing me out real bad. I had never felt anything so desperate. It was calling out to me. Why don't you sit in the chair? To show me something. <gasps> Damn it! I thought I could protect her. Idiot! What would you think of me? I failed you. I failed us. Who's us? It's all falling apart. What? Yes, I know. Who is he talking no, to? No, I need to be sure. Who are you talking to? There's got to be something around here. You want what? Fuck! <sighs> Look who finally decided to let me out of my cage. And only when you need my help. Mm. Surprise. Surprise. Okay, you know what? I'm not in the mood. Just tell me what you see. Come on. Come on. Yes. I can feel it. Okay. It's around here somewhere. Oh, well, that's real fucking specific. Hey, I'm trying to help here. Well, you know, sometimes I wonder. Well, it doesn't make it easier when you keep me in the dark for so long. Oh, Christ. Thanks for that, by the way. <laughs> Hell of a way to treat your soulmate. God damn it! There's nothing here! There is. Really? I'm never wrong about these things. <laughs> you know that. Well, oh, screw this. I should have known better than to listen to you. Wait, what? There. There. Where? What? Huh? Oh, yes. This is. 
is it? Okay. What? You building tension? Grab the fucking thing! Would you shut up? Huh? Okay. It's her. It's her. No. No, 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 no. Page after page. It's like he's obsessed. What has he... What have I done? We couldn't have known. <sighs> I let him into my home. You know, he was like a father to me. How could he do this to her? F fucking bastard! Who could he? I told you we couldn't trust anyone but ourselves. Keep it together. Think. What do we do now? We wait. And when he comes back, I'll just... Whoa, 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 easy, Tiger. Remember what's at stake here. Just let me do what I do. You better do it fast. Because if you don't, I will kill him. Thomas, I wasn't expecting you. Is uh, everything all right, my friend? Did you do it, friend? Did I? What? My daughter. My 13-year-old daughter. I entrusted her to you. Thomas. Did you do it? I... I don't... I found the sketchbook. Forced myself to look through it. Cover to cover. Every single fucking page! Tell me you didn't hurt her, Richard. Thomas, please. Tell me I'm wrong, Richard. Tell me, and I'll let you go. I... It wasn't me, Thomas. You have to understand. There's this thing inside of me. Shut up. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. You, you have to believe me. I wanted to die. I'll make it quick. Thomas... I'm so sorry. She's my daughter. I, I, I never wanted any of this. I, I, I should never have come here. But you did. Uh, 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 no one should uh, here. Knowing uh, what she means to me. Uh, Thomas, I, I swear I'll go away. You'll never wait. What are you? No. Let me out. Let me out. Let me in.
This cancer has spread far enough. Time to cut it out. Um, okay. Ooh, that got deep and dark really fast. Um, sheesh. Uh, wow. I didn't know that's where this story was going. Holy moly. We're now, we're Thomas. I guess we're playing for Thomas for a little bit. Um, I'm going to stop the episode there. Um, this is really heavy. Um, so, uh, I'm probably going to put some kind of trigger at the beginning of this episode. Um, just because of the content. Whew. Um, yeah, this, this, I, I'm sorry, y'all. That, that whole cutscene just, I can't even talk anymore. Um, yeah, if this was triggering, I, I hope you take care of yourself. Um, no one deserves anything like that. And you certainly didn't deserve it. Um, I, I really don't know what to say, but, uh, as always, take care of yourselves. I love y'all. Um, come back for more, right? Bye.